Uh, the genesis of the idea of, of the particle separator period came from helicopters landing in the desert. They used their particle separation to, to keep the helicopters from crashing. Uh, and what we did is we scaled that down and made it work for UTVs. There are devices out on the market today that uh, help keep you cool on your ride, but the problem is they're all filter-based products, and, and those those quickly clog. And once they clog, you're going to see your airflow dramatically decrease. We said, hey, we already make a great particle separator for the engine. Why can't we do this for the helmet as well? And that's kind of where the helmet separator was born. In, in simple terms, the particle separator works by pulling in dirty air and using centrifugal force to spin the debris and dust to the outer walls of the vortexes where it is scavenged and sucked out by our scavenge fan and ejected from the vehicle. The nice thing is, is when we talk about airflow, we talk about the beginning airflow, what's your airflow at the beginning of a race, and, and ours is going to be 54 CFM, and at the end of the race it's going to be 54 CFM because we don't have any filter to clog. So when designing this product, we knew that, that helmet noise was important. You know, you, you got a lot going on in the vehicle, a lot of noises, and we wanted to, to make sure we created an environment where you could always clearly hear your co-driver and the noise, the noise from our system never bothered you, and we achieved that by a large margin. Let's talk about the stats. Airflow, 54 CFM at the beginning and end of the race. Efficiency, 99.36%. Air pressure, 3.03 .03 inches of water. Helmet noise, 79 decibels. We covered all our bases with testing. We didn't want to just meet your expectations. We wanted to exceed your expectations by a mile.